Okay, here's a uh, little video. Uh, I'm making a OtterBox review. Um, I figure I got to take my box off my OtterBox out because I got to clean my phone. Um, <clears throat> this is a OtterBox uh, for my Nokia E71, which is an awesome phone. Um, it's not as fast as the new ones, but it can do a lot more than I see a lot of people's phones do uh, for a lot less money. Um, anyways, I've had this for a year. This month is a year. Um, in this case, I'm, I'm really hard on my stuff. Um, this thing has been dropped. It's been in the snow. It's fallen in a puddle. Um, you know, dropped on concrete. And there is nothing wrong other than one little ding in the corner right there. Um, that's it. The only problem I have with it is <clears throat> I have to take it apart every couple months to clean the screen and stuff because I, uh, I, I it's hard for me to see uh, what's going on. It gets dirty. The other thing is the cover on the on the camera lens and the flash. Uh, when I take a picture, primarily indoors. I mean, the camera on this thing isn't the best, anyways. But uh, oops, we're going out of focus. Uh, when I take a picture, the flash causes uh, ghosting on the left side of the pictures. It's primarily indoors. Out outdoors. Um, I don't have a problem with it. Of course, I don't know if the flash goes off. I don't know if it's automatic flash or not. I can't remember. But anyways, this is uh, this is it for the for the uh, E71. I'll pull it apart here. Um, let me set the camera down. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, so here we have it. We're gonna let me zoom this out. Okay, the uh, rubber case comes out. The other thing too that's really impressive about this case is that I mean I put my phone on the charger every night. So the little flap that that covers uh, the charging port, that thing is still like brand new. Um, as you can see here, there's there's nothing wrong with it. This rubber, it's extremely durable. Um, as well as the on the the rubber for the on off switch. Um, you know, there's there's nothing wrong with this thing at all. It's it, Stinking holds up excellent. Um, I gotta quit moving around here so much. So that's the rubber, the rubber protector. Then you have the hard case, uh, which this in itself is stinking awesome. Um, this is the one that has a little ding on it. Let's see if I can get a close up. Ah, you can't see. All right. Right there in the very corner. It's not the best. The lighting's not the best in here. It's dirty, as you can see. You know, sawdust. Christ, climbing under cars. This, that, the other thing. Okay, so anyways, oops, we'll uh, take the case off here. It's top-notch quality. Here's the front. You gotta clean your screen protector there. Otherwise, you can't see the phone. Then it has the uh, plastic wrap for the uh, for your keypad. Which, when I first got this, I thought, man, that is pretty cheesy. But look at my phone. Freaking thing looks brand new. Nothing wrong with this phone. 
It's an excellent phone. Can't say enough about it. Um, the uh, keypad protector is static plastic. You know, it just sticks by by static. Um, as you can see, it's pretty filthy. Again, I got to get that pulled off. Oh, let's see here. Once again, there's something to be said for having fingernails, which I don't have any. So let me just get a little screwdriver here. Oh, how'd my YouTube page come up? There we go. Boy, that stuff sticks awesomely. Awesomely. Okay, that comes off. And as you can see here, my phone it's like a brand new phone. Get a better shot with this camera here. Yep, yeah, see, it's kept this phone. I can polish it up there a little bit. Anywho, straight talk. Their service is excellent for $45 a month unlimited everything can't freaking beat it the only problem I had is I was recently in New Mexico Red River New Mexico as you, I got a couple videos on my page are showing it I had no service from Red River all the way I had to get to the almost right into Taos New Mexico which is like a 45 minute drive I was there for 12 days and I was going nuts I, I'd had uh, no phone I could get uh, connect to Wi-Fi uh, down in Red River but where I was was up on the mountain and it was a five minute drive down into Red River so you know when you're used to having your phone being able to check your emails um, you know your websites all this and that it's uh, very frustrating anyways here's that plastic plastic uh, keypad protector. Like I say, when I first got it, I thought it was pretty, you know, I was like, man, this ain't gonna hold up. But this thing has done freaking awesome. Now, I know I've seen people do reviews on there where they they don't have this plastic protector on. I don't know what that... I mean, when you get your otter box, it's easy to miss this thing. Um, because it is transparent, and it's just stuck in it just looks like part of the packing or something but that's your your keypad protector and you got to have it because without this you know what good's the outer box other than you know keeping your phone protected from a drop but it doesn't see a lot of any dust or debris so anyways that's it that's the outer box the front um, good well made well made Definitely worth the investment uh, for any phone you have. Um, it's definitely worth it. Goes together easy. Um, like I say, recommend it. Um, here's that piece of plastic that goes over the the, the uh, camera, and the flash gets in there and causes some ghosting. So. All right, that's it. Excellent, excellent protector. Remember, straight talk doesn't work in Red River, New Mexico. Got to go to Taos. You can go over the hill. It'll work in uh, Eagle's Nest or whatever. It's up over the mountain, but not in Red River. I forgot to include uh, <clears throat> the holster, whatever you want to call it, um, for the Otter Box goes in your belt. Um, this comes on and off of me several times a day and uh, the ratcheting mechanism is still like new. Uh, the clamp still like new and the phone snaps in. 
beautiful the whole setup awesome so there you have it